This ROM is just like any other custom ROM based on Cyanogen mod. But in this ROM, Xperia apps are included and the UI is made to look like any Xperia device. All the tweaks of this ROM are present in settings, XOSP settings. And this is for status bar personalization. Turn on for XOSP logo. And you can also customize the font of this date and time. Like here it's changed to italic, right, etc. And you can also seconds. And you can also turn on network traffic information on the status bar and this is for lock screen personalization if you turn on this it's like this the lock screen will be blurred and this is for status bar personalizations now the status bar is like this you turn on this you can see this it's all blurred and this is for blurring notifications and blurring status bar header quick settings now all this is blurred and even notifications are blurred And this is for personalization of buttons, on screen navigation bar. This is for backlight of buttons, double tap to sleep on navigation bar. And you can customize the actions of long press, double tap. And this is relating to volume buttons and you can remove system apps with this and this tap to wake is not working presently it might work in future and double tap to sleep on status bar and some other stuff and if you enable this option, it will show the charging current while charging on the lock screen. The ROM also comes with wiper effects. And this is XOSP Delta. This is used for updating the ROM. And this ROM is based on Android Marshmallow 6.0.1. The UI in this ROM is modified to look exactly like an Xperia device. And even the battery icon looks exactly like the one in Xperia device. And some Xperia apps. Xperia album. and Sony Music and this ROM comes with a Snapdragon camera I'll post the sample images taken with this ROM In this ROM, screen recorder comes pre-installed and weather XOSP file manager.
This ROM also has Cyanogen mod Teams engine. And coming to the bugs of this ROM, if we open security, it's giving a four star. This is present on all ROMs based on Cyanogen mod at present. This will be fixed very soon. Except this bug, the ROM is stable for daily use. So that's it for now guys. Thanks for watching the video. If you like the video, press the like button. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you haven't already.